actually our last speaker, uh, and then we have a few other things to do, but our last speaker is Maggie Helwig from Church of St. Stephen in the Fields. She's been very involved in the Line 9 campaign as well. And uh, yeah, give it up. Thank you. As the previous speaker began by saying, on the face of it, the decision to take a 40-year-old pipeline in bad condition, reverse it, and pump much, much more corrosive oil through it is such a stupid decision, it's hard to see how anyone could think it was a good idea. But when people are caught up in a sick and distorted system, people make sick and distorted decisions. That's how it works. Line 9 is a kind of a micro-symptom. Line 9 is connected to the tar sand exploitation. Line 9 is connected to fracking. All of these are connected to the fact that we live in a society which is pathologically dependent on the exploitation of fossil fuels. And the reason that we are living in that society is that we have been caught up in a system which treats short-term economic profit as the only value that counts. We are here, all of us are here from different faith traditions, philosophical traditions, political standpoints, because we do not believe that. Because we believe it is possible to live by a different system of values. The capitalist, profit-driven system in which we live is demanding from all of us that we consume more and more to keep it going and that we dig more and more resources out of the earth, that we cause more and more climate change, that we push ourselves further and further towards the brink in order to keep that system going. It's all those cars running up and down University Avenue. It's all these buildings. It's all of this in which we are enmeshed and we are here to try to create something different, something better. I am here, I'm here, and the caller might be a bit of a giveaway on this, representing a faith tradition which is profoundly complicit. I am here representing a faith tradition which has supported, encouraged, participated in, and benefited deeply from colonialism, racism, environmental devastation, and the capitalist system in general. We need to wear that. We need to be responsible to that. Part of trying to be responsible to that is being here with you today, is working on the Line 9 campaign, is working on all of these campaigns to try to create a different and better world. We are all responsible. We are all needed. Another world is possible, but it depends on all of you, on all of us.